Hi everyone, I'm Jim and welcome to the review of Awaken, the debut studio album by the band Flesh Killer. Today we're celebrating the 5th anniversary of the record, so I've decided to go back, listen to it and see if it still holds up or not. Flesh Killer is basically Extol, as you can see here we have the lineup, all Borrowed, I don't know, or Beard, I don't know how to pronounce <laughs> his name. He's known from Extol, and this band is basically Extol 2.0. I've heard this album when it was released because I've been waiting for it, and I wasn't disappointed. Here's my setup as usual, the production is tight, everything sounds clean and heavy, I really dig it. The message is about Christianity, it's about God. The structure is progressive, because the band plays progressive death metal. Let's just rate individual songs. The opening track, Parallel Kingdom, is a really good beginning. I enjoy the riffs here, the drumming, the bass, everything. I am just not a big fan of clean singing on this song. It's not as good as on some of the other songs, still a great song, 8 out of 10. Salt of the Earth is the weakest song on the record. I enjoy most of it, but some of the riffs are too happy for my taste. And again, the singing is just not that great. Everything else, perfect. So 7 out of 10. Wisdom is a banger, it has that black metal vibe, some tremolo stuff, some blasts, I adore the growls here, those vocals are great, and actually the singing is good as well, I am surprised by this song, I really like to replay it, check it out, 9 out of 10. I could say the same thing about Secret Chambers, I really dig the weird atmosphere of this song, especially in the verses. I don't like some of the happy stuff, but everything else, just beautiful. 9 out of 10. Awaken is my favorite song on this record. The riffs are just so good here, you know. The drumming, the riffs, everything. I love the structure of this song, the verses, the intro, that melodic pre-chorus. It's just amazing. Definitely a highlight of this record. I've heard this song more times than I've been in a church. 11 out of 10. Inherit is another banger, my second favorite song on this record. What really grabs me here is the verse music, you know, the riffs and the drums here. I really dig it. The rest of the song is great as well, but those verse riffs, dude, just amazing, amazing stuff. I love to come back to this song, 10 out of 10. Evil Eclipse. This is another of these songs that, while I really enjoy the instrumental side of the track, the vocals are not as good. That singing again, I think, doesn't fit the track. So, 7 out of 10. True Image. I have similar thoughts about this track as the one before it. The instrumental work really good. The singing, not my cup of tea again. 7 out of 10. Warfare. Now this song is actually great, while the previous two were good but had some weak vocals, here almost everything is fine. I like to replay this stuff. Great riffs, great atmosphere, 8 out of 10. And the final song, Window of Time. It's very melodic and happy sounding for most part, but I really dig it actually. Even the singing is nice here. A great ending to this album, 8 out of 10. To sum it all up, the consistency is stable, the songs are either good or great or masterpieces, the flow is fitting, you're not going to skip anything, replayability, hell yeah, it's a great album. I wouldn't change a thing here, sure some of the songs are weaker like the second one or the seventh and the eighth one, but these are not bad songs or even average. They're good, just some of the singing doesn't land here for me. I'm just not a fan of these types of vocals, but the growling and screaming was perfect. Even some of the singing was 
Right For Me. I recommend this album to anyone who likes progressive music. If you don't believe in God, you still can enjoy it just like me. I hope that Flesh Killer will release a new album because it's been 5 years since the last one. We need some new music, dudes. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you in my next review. Bye!